orbitals. Good. And now let's click on dissolve. Maybe double click. Yep. Now let's click six and eight. Open. Gaussian cube, load. Okay. And now let's play these representations. So let's replace lines with dynamic bonds. Very good. Uh, add create rep. Change it to VMD or uh, VDV, Van der Waals. Okay. Uh, now. Then you want the do you want the same thing, the isosurface? Yes. yes. Isosurface. Oh, ho, 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 ho. it's very yeah. different. That's right? very different, yes. <laughs> and this so, one has negative and positive too. So. Yes, yes. Let's uh, color it. Let's use blue for negative and red for uh, positive. So okay. coloring so, method, coloring, coloring method. No, 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 no. Oh. Whoa, slowly, slowly. A little, yes. Uh, color ID should be about 10 down. Yes, color ID, yes, blue. And make it instead of material opaque, change to transparent. Otherwise, we will not see through. Okay. Now let's uh, cr uh, create rep. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, and now let's go to yeah, positive and change color to red. Zero, zero, color ID is zero, one. Beautiful, very beautiful. Now let's orient it that it shows uh, this uh, dissolved up just to use human. Um, uh, let me click and, and rotate. Okay. I think from, from this angle would, would be most beautiful. Too big, too big, I think it's more. About this one. Yeah, agreed. Okay, uh, please make a screenshot. And then you said Shift Command 4. Shift Command 4, yes. And then uh, select the area. Oh, <laughs> well, give me one uh, second. We'll redo that one. <laughs> 